It gives me great honor, and I am equally humbled to be conferred today as the patron of the Fiji Girl Guides Association. I thank you all for joining me in today's ceremony with your presence. This ceremony and my investiture as a patron to the Girl Guides Association is rather special to His Excellency and I because as a young girl, this was a movement they was a part of. It taught me to care for the environment and my neighbors and to learn life skills at an early age, which I still hold close to my heart today. Girl Guides was further enhanced because my mother-in-law, Ms. Mbale Baningi, who was also a school teacher, became a movement leader. So Girl Guides became a part of our lives. I take this time to honor her memory and acknowledge the hard work that she has the and the pioneer of Girl Guides in Fiji, such as Andi Seni Melidaya, contributed to set the platform for us today. I also specifically acknowledge this special occasion as I now join the ranks of former ladies who had been seemingly honored to serve you as a patron. Being patron to such a big voluntary character, building association is a privilege. I look forward to working with the Fiji Girl Guides Association in fulfilling its purpose to empower its members to contribute to a caring, peaceful, and just world, while also providing opportunities which support the development of capable, creative, resilient, and resourceful girls. The foremost principle in the Girl Guides promise is to do our best and our duty to God first, to the country, to others, and to keep the guide law. The guide laws have morals and values that are much needed in this modern era of technological advancement because on the other hand, it enhances output and productivity, but on the other, it increases the gap in personal relationships with interactions with one another. The Fiji Girl Guides Association promotes a holistic approach dealing with intellect, the spiritual, the physical, the emotion, social, and moral development. As a mother and a grandmother, this approach is very close to my heart, as I am always striving and hopeful that my children and grandchildren grow and become wholesome individuals who are resourceful and self-sufficient enough to think and fend for themselves later on, as well as being patriotic and to contributing global citizens. As patron, I would like to invite and encourage more girls and young women to join the Fiji Girl Guide Association in our schools. And this record appeals to the Ministry of Education, Heritage and Arts, the Ministry of Youth and Sports, and the Ministry of Women, Children and Poverty to support the promotion of the Girl Guides movement in our schools and communities. I take this acknowledge and thank all of you present today, particularly the Permanent Secretary of the Ministry of Education, Heritage and Arts, and the Chief Commissioner for the Fiji Scouts Association. It is my hope that the Fiji Girl Guides Association and the Fiji Scout Association will work together even more collaboratively than before with the focus of empowering 
and train our young people to become responsible and reliable citizens of our beloved nation. In conclusion, I would like to acknowledge the President of the Fiji Girl Guide Association and the senior executives for your continuous commitment and dedication to the cause of the association. As Girl Guides, our motto is be prepared. Life will throw curveballs on our way. We experienced this during the peak of the COVID-19 peak of the COVID-19 pandemic in our country and all over the world where we had to recognize ourselves to remain functional. Our motto demands that our association conducts activities that are intent to prepare members to handle new situation, unexpected situation and challenges with determination, confidence and a sense of self-assuredness. It further demands that as girl guides, girl guides, we are forward-thinking and always ready to deal with anything that might come on our way while looking out for one another to ensure that no one is left behind. It is my prayer that I will leave the same lasting impact on my own grandchildren and all the young girls of Fiji. I personally assure you all my total support and well wishes to the Fiji Girl Guides Association in your future plans and endeavors. May the Almighty bless you all. <laughs>